this weekend on Long Island. I was watching TV. I'll be there nine twenty two. Is it on Long Island or in? Long I think Island? they say on Long Island because I said in Long Island on the Patreon. Well, people incorrect. got mad at me. That's probably what <clears throat> I believe it's on. We were watching this show on TLC. It's called Ninety Day Fiance. It's like where people mm. get engaged to yeah, an infant. A ninety from, day. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. A Asia <laughs> Argento <laughs> reality show. They get engaged to the boy to game. How fucked up is it that Anthony Bourdain <laughs> killed himself because his wife was cheating on him with a baby? <laughs> That is really funny. Baby, up. please get Rock that star shit. baby out of your pussy. <laughs> that's my, that's my, uh, uh, what's his name? Bourdain. Mm. It's anyway, basically Obama. They're about people finding, yeah. uh, like, I'm Anthony Bourdain. I'm Anthony Bourdain. I'm gay, and I'm, also Ryan I'm Shuck. gay and I'm Ryan Shuck. <laughs> 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 so anyway so yes they find like people online or whatever and they fall in love with them and they bring them to the states and then in order to get a green card you have to get married within 90 days mm. so a lot of them are just like you know horny like middle-aged men like they're, they're paying like asian women they're like yeah like in i Cambodia. like like filipino style women like i've been married four times but they like <laughs> they have the best feet you know like those kind of guys there was one guy that was clearly getting catfished by a colombian Hell man yeah. who's just awesome. sending him nudes from some random woman awesome. she had like different tattoos and different of Filipino, pictures it's Philippi hole and it's a sounding community yeah that's cool. that's good too yeah. so Asian people they're like yeah I love to get uh <laughs> will you shove a, a pencil <laughs> on my dick hole yeah that's yeah that's <laughs> I'm Philippi hole yeah yeah that's I'm actually good. Korean I love, yeah, right. no I love I love wearing sandals <laughs> and having a pencil shoved in my dick hole that's <laughs> Philippi hole that's Philippi hole he's got a name like <laughs> Juan Sanchez. Yeah, I love that. So I love this, when they when they have Sanchez. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There's this massively fat woman from Georgia. She's like got like a super deep voice from like 80 years of smoking cigarettes. Awesome. Hell yeah. And some Nigerian guy yes. just wrote her a Facebook yes. message. Please let like, me touch all you of You are so beautiful. You are and such she's a like, big bitch. Oh my God. He stole my heart right there and then. Wow. So they start like they start messaging and stuff, and then she's like, "I see he's been interacting with other women on social media." So I'm going over to Nigeria, and I'm no. gonna propose to him. I'm gonna say, "You're gonna get married to me, or we're gonna break up," because I can't do this anymore. Are you kidding? She yeah. went to Nigeria, so she goes. Did the to show Nigeria. follow her there? The show follows her to yes. Nigeria. Damn, they got like, that kind of budget on 90 Day Fiance. Well, she paid. I mean, well, I guess the production yeah. staff had to pay, but whatever. It's it's a fucking sick show. It's yeah. really. Cool. Yeah. Um, I'm trying to get into reality shows. More reality shows. I got to do that. It is a really good show. Now you should I'm, watch this. I'm one. off social media. I should get back into fucking HGTV. And yeah, yeah. Me. I've been watching Chopped like it's my damn job, dude. Yeah. I love Chopped. So he's like, I cannot have any pictures of you on my phone because if I get pulled over by police, then they see pictures of a white woman, they're gonna think I'm a scammer, and I'm definitely not a scammer <laughs> because everyone thinks. Because I'm Nigerian, that I'm a scammer. <laughs> like it's a stereotype that I have to deal with all the time. It must suck to be the actual prince of Nigeria. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Did somebody already did. did Probably, that? but who? Okay, you know. whatever. We did that. Good luck, Jonathan. Did that one time. What? I forgot what the bit was. We just Isn't, mentioned his name. Oh no, his friends being like, "Oh, you know what? I'm going to call you. <laughs> I'm going to call you. Good luck." Because I forgot what the setup was. <laughs> yeah, whatever. No idea. Anyway, so she gets <laughs> yeah. to Nigeria. She no. gets to Nigeria, and there's like you know, fuck it. This massively <clears throat> fat. Like, just real quick, Nigeria. Nigeria. Yeah, Nigeria. Mm -hmm. just real quick. Yeah. Um, and then she mm -hmm. gets to the house, and it's like I would like, like to suck on your penis. <laughs> Go ahead, Adam. <laughs> or uh, even better, Nigeria, and it's just okay. <laughs> no, <laughs> it's, it's, a, it's a different version of Nigeria. <laughs> and she gets off the plane. She gets to his house, you know, and this is like dirt. So we're talking house. some like big fat. I'm guessing blonde Southern bitch. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but she's like a grand. Coming up next on Big Fat, I'm <laughs> guessing blonde Southern bitch. <laughs> no, you got it. <laughs> you got it. Yeah, yeah. and uh, she's like. Um, yeah, I guess I'm blonde. She's like, so anyway, I got you a gift from the United States. And she pulls out a MAGA hat, a Trump t-shirt, yes. American flags, like a whole so like what out, is like this Trump bitch outfit? So she's going, <laughs> she's literally going to Africa <laughs> to try and get an immigrant, <laughs> a scammer. <laughs> God she damn, makes, what a dumb she bitch. Makes this poor, <laughs> she makes this African guy put on all the Trump stuff. He's like, this is so cool. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just finish this fucking podcast so I can bust my pants. I can't wait to bust. You just need to jack off, dude. I but told I you. I thought we all made a pact not to jack off this but whole you, trip. You've been fucking... I, I don't know how to tell this to you, but you've been fucking mm. sleep busting every night. 
Nocturnal should, that should have been a reality show, Bust House. <laughs> <laughs> Bust House, five guys <laughs> in a house, and they're like, none of them are allowed to jack off, and it's just guys quietly jacking off on night vision camera. <laughs> and they have like a computer room, and it's like, they're just meeting in the morning, and there's a guy with his shirt off making a protein shake. <laughs> and he's like, yeah, bro, I got to talk to you because I went to go get a glass of water last night, and I saw you busting. Ba-dum-bum. <laughs> bust. Like, just a tight shot of the Tyler, other I face. saw you bust I swear night. I wasn't busting. I wasn't busting. I, I was edged. edging. <laughs> I edged for a while, but I didn't bust. <laughs> Tyler and Sasha debate whether he busted or not. Coming up on Bust House. <laughs> nah, dude, you couldn't let the bus. You'd have dude, to I asked you several times, stop bringing up that girl with big tits we saw. Don't and, say the word breast. Don't with that girl we saw with big <laughs> boop. Don't sit and they like blur his mouth when he says tits. <laughs> Bust house. Bust house. Dude. That sounds you great. You cannot watch fucking commercials for fucking mm. bikini waxes. You cannot watch a fucking Summer's Eve douche commercial. <laughs> it gets me too fucking horny, bro. Um, it, like, Eric has some news to share with the group. Uh, the producers found out that I actually have testicular cancer, which prevents me from busting to begin with. So they're asking me to leave the show. <laughs> the boys, go play putt-putt golf to send Eric off. <laughs> One last hang before Eric has to leave because he lied about his testicular cancer. <laughs> Bro, honestly, when I found out your nuts didn't work, I felt really betrayed, yeah. bro. Yeah, you know, he's fake as hell, I just can't dude. wait till we get back to the clubhouse and we can play <laughs> Wii. <laughs> Goddamn. You people would watch it. I would legitimately watch that. <laughs> yeah, I would watch Bust House. <laughs> Honestly, I'm thinking about it. That would be a challenging thing to do. Yeah. To live it. But they're you. just constantly beating off. No, no, no. no, no. But in a scenario where there's like the cameras are watching you and every yeah. time you grab your cock, it's like, wah, wah, or something. No, shit. it's not. It's just that it's 10 guys in a house <laughs> and they're not supposed to beat off, but you don't get anything for not beating off. Oh, there's no that's prize. just the rule. But oh. people you're keep talking about the how, they, how they're there to win. Yeah. So they're they're like, like, I'm not here to make friends, <laughs> even I'm though here, I have. I'm here to not beat off. <laughs> I'm here to not bust. <laughs> and then they're just constantly beating off. <laughs> Yeah. Eric, I could tell that you're beating off right now. No, I'm not, dude. Mm. There was cum all over the spatula. That is think. honestly such an interesting fuck. We should pitch Bust House because <laughs> because I honestly would watch that. <laughs> <laughs> is there a prize or is it just like There's Jersey no Shore? prize. There's no point to it. <laughs> There's not even. They a- have to go to work, right? The way all those shows are. No, yeah, they have to work at like a No, uh, they don't have cell phones. Oh, there's like challenges. Yeah, yeah. They're like they tried to yeah, they tried to work <laughs> at the local burrito fiesta. But Eric beat off. <laughs> <laughs> the boys immediately started beating off. <laughs> But unfortunately, they employed a pretty hot 15-year-old a, hostess. A 15-year-old girl was working there, and they couldn't help but take turns beating off in the bathroom. <laughs> Just looking at her and closing your eyes because you were... Bro, remember. we weren't in the house. <laughs> we all caved. Bro, that's we, my little on, cousin, bro. <laughs> yeah, they're just standing around in a circle, and there's tiki torches in the backyard next to the jacuzzi. And they're like, we all promised we wouldn't bust at Burrito Fiesta. <laughs> We all said we wouldn't do it, and we all failed the challenge, and that's on all of us. <laughs> and we're going to learn and grow from this. But um, bum bum, but a bum bum, bust house. So, does anyone get eliminated? Um, no, you have no, to, right? you, you no. just get caught, and everyone's so it's just, It's Jersey Shore, but. But it's about beating on, not beating on. <laughs> There's no rules, that's, basically, that's the, other than you can't That's what bust. binds these people together. Yeah. It's not busting. And then at the end, they realize that they've made friendships for a lifetime. You know? And the, it's through showing that masturbation is evil. What you can accomplish by not busting. Yeah, male friendship. Because mm-hmm. you know that busting gets in the way of men being friends with each other. You know, you want to you wanna throw a... We're so catty. You, know? you want to throw jealous. a fucking a wrench in there? Yeah. Put a gay guy in there. Oh my god! Well, I'll tell you what. It would be cool if one of them, his dick didn't work. I, I think. Whoa! So. And and he was tricking all of them. But then the show is sponsored by BlueChew.com. <laughs>